Good morning, this is Chris Payne filling in for Bob Payne to deliver this week's market update. It was another big week on the Street of Dreams as major indices yet again hit new record highs with the S&P 500 crossing 4,500 and the NASDAQ composite clearing 15,000 for the first time ever. Despite surging COVID cases, more turmoil in Afghanistan and slowing but solid economic data, stocks continue to march higher, climbing the proverbial wall of worry. Meanwhile, pricing pressures are mounting as the Federal Reserve's favorite inflation gauge came in hot. The July Personal Consumption Expenditures Price Index rose 4.2% from a year ago, the biggest jump since the 1990s. Wow. More evidence of inflationary pressure might be here longer than had been expected. However, the biggest financial news of the week came on Friday when Fed Chairman Jerome Powell indicated that the central bank is likely to begin withdrawing some of its easy money policies before the end of the year. But he still sees interest rate hikes way off in the distance. Markets rejoiced and traded higher, while government bond yields move lower. Because apparently, the punch bowl of stimulus isn't going away anytime soon. So this big booming bull market continues as economies around the world recover from COVID-19 and the central banks keep financial conditions loose. Now, if you're sitting there wondering, how do I benefit from the current economic environment? Do I have a portfolio positioned to win and achieve my goals? Why sit there and wonder when you can know? We have 75 years of combined industry experience building low-cost, tax-efficient, goal-based portfolios. All you have to do is text or call 844-752-6692. That's 844-752-6692. Or just simply call 844 plan NYC. That's 844-P-L-A-N-N-Y-C. This is Chris Payne, Vice President and Senior Financial Advisor at Payne Capital Management.